Hi, my name's Wendy and I had leukaemia. Hey, my name's Rachel and like Wendy, I also had leukaemia. We met because we were both diagnosed a day apart at the same doctor's room. Wendy was in the bed opposite me. So I had to share a room with her for like <laughs> months and months, let me tell you. <laughs> we were both quite young then, so I was 19 and Rachel was 17. It was really hard, I really thought I was on my way out. Yeah, it was all pretty scary. And at that point in time I was pretty low on all my counts actually, but I did have a pretty hefty load of blood products which gave me that little bit of extra energy just to pick myself up and keep going. We had plasma, we had immunoglobulins, platelets. It takes 432 people to keep the two of us alive for the duration of our treatment. For me, receiving these blood products has allowed me to live. You know, to have a future, to have a hope, to have a family, to help others, to be a voice, to be an advocate. We got to grow up. We got to get married, travel, have children, have a house full of crazy rescue animals, you know, all these things that we, we would never have had without it. Yep. So. I've travelled, I've lived overseas in some crazy countries. Um, I've given of myself, um, always trying to help others. Um, it has really shaped our lives. The gift that other people have given us um, was just so important. We are where we are today because of donors, because people rolled up their shirt sleeves and gave blood. Um, it may have made them squeamish and maybe they didn't <laughs> like it, but for us it was gold. Um, and we thank you. For anyone out there who hasn't donated, whatever it is that's stopping you from doing so, be brave, go out there and do it because the difference that you make is absolutely amazing. Mm -hmm.